Let's go through last week's top stories. After decades of NGO-aided advocacy efforts, Ecuador's National System of Protected Areas now includes the over 13,000-acre ancestral Tiwi Nunca forest. The Shuar indigenous community of El Quim lives in and relies on it for sustenance and many cultural practices. A wildfire has burned through half of the Buhashem Forest Reserve in northern Morocco, one of the few remaining refuges of the Barbary macaque. The fire forced the evacuation of more than 900 families from 15 villages. Of the 4,000 macaques in the forest, 23 have been found dead so far. Increasingly severe flooding in Bangladesh threatens the homes and livelihoods of some 10 million people who live on river islands known as chars. The government and NGOs are supporting char communities to raise the height of their homesteads 8 to 12 feet in plinth designs to protect people and their homes during the monsoon. That's all the news I've got for you. Have a great week, everyone.